Assalamu alaikum. Insha'Allah, today I'm going to tell you a story. One day, the Holy Prophet of Allah was walking alone in the city. While passing by a market, he saw a person who was trying to sell his camel. The Prophet liked this camel a lot, and after a careful inspection, he decided to buy it. The Prophet bought the camel for an agreed price. But the Prophet did not have any money on him, so he asked the camel dealer to follow him up to his home to pay his due. The seller happily agreed, as the Prophet had agreed for a fair price for the camel. As they were walking, another man approached and asked the camel dealer if he was selling this camel. The camel dealer said that he had already sold the camel to the Holy Prophet for such an amount. This man offered to pay a larger amount for the camel and asked the dealer if he was willing to sell it. The camel dealer, in his greed for more money, ignored the deal he made with the Prophet and agreed to sell the camel to the person. The Prophet, who was silently watching all this, pointed out to the camel dealer that he had already sold the camel to him and it was wrong to break the agreement just like that. The camel dealer started lying and denied making any agreement. While all this was going on, the passers-by stopped and wondered as to what was going on. One of them was a companion of the Prophet. He immediately approached the Prophet and asked what was going on. The Prophet told them exactly what happened. O oh, Prophet of Allah, do you have any witnesses to support your claim? The companion asked. No, replied the Prophet. We have no witnesses as there was no one present when the agreement was made, he added. Sorry, we don't think we can help you, the companion said. How can we be sure who is telling the truth and who is lying? An elderly man who had excellent reputation was passing by when he saw the mob. He was a follower of Islam too, but not a companion. When he saw the Prophet surrounded by people, he immediately approached him. He inquired what was going on, and the people told him what happened. The Prophet وسلم, of Allah is telling the truth, and the camel dealer is lying. He said without hesitating. The people gathered round accepted his decision and asked the camel dealer not to sell his camel to a third person. The Prophet paid the dealer after reaching home as they had initially agreed. After a few days, the Prophet met this elderly man who had helped him. You were not present when the agreement was made, the Prophet asked. So how could you judge without being there? O oh, Prophet of Allah, replied the wise old man, you said that there is Allah and we believed you, even though we haven't seen him. You told us about angels, heaven and hell, and we believed you, even though we haven't seen all these things. How is it possible that then you would lie about such pity thing? The Prophet thanked the old man. The moral of this story is that even though the Prophet's companions walked, sat and dead with him, some of them never fully understood him. If they had, they would have never asked for proof and they would have trusted his word blindly, like the wise old man.